Let's get the welder and the rest of the stuff to start working on the exhaust system for the Blondie. start working on the blondie we're gonna start doing all the exhaust system and this is what I have for it I got this kit that comes with all the bins that I need and they're all mandrel bins as you can see and this is gonna be the muffler which is a magna flow and I'm also gonna put two resonators are these babies right here and I'm pretty sure it's gonna sound pretty neat but yeah this is the, the beginning of the exhaust system for the blondie the downside is that my brother Fernando had to work today so he might be able to make it if he comes out early he said he was gonna show up but for now I'm gonna start working on it. I got it. my cup of coffee. I got the, the uh, parts, and let me show you this one. This is the uh, pipes out of a 2012 Dodge Ram. So I just put them together, and it's got scratches and all that. But I, I was like, what the hell? It's gonna match the truck, and I'm probably thinking. And I'm gonna run them somewhere right here in front of the rear tire. But yeah, that's the plan for today. Let me get everything set up and start working on the RAM charger. And so far, we are halfway done. As you can see, that's the side that comes from the left side of the motor it goes underneath the tranny around the, the transmission pan then it connects to the first uh, resonator from there we're gonna have a small section of two and a half right there and then from here it's gonna be all the way to the exhaust so I still need two bands right here and two straight tubes and right now I'm working on the other side of the exhaust but it's coming along pretty good it's looking good and now let's go see how it looks from the bottom so here's the other resonator that we're going to be using So that's gonna be right there. It's coming from there. This one needs to go higher. About right there. And the other resonator is gonna be man, it's gonna be kinda tight. But it's doable. It is doable. We'll see. See how it looks after after I'm done with it. But yeah, we're making good progress on this exhaust. I'm 
not gonna lie, but this is a badass looking exhaust. Check it out. It's almost done. And look who's here. Say hi. You know, say hola. <laughs> That's my little helper. Yeah, we're working in progress. We're almost done. And now let me show you how the exhaust looks like in sound after everything is done. I also delete all the uh, the vacuum system, which was all the canisters that were right here. So I took all that off. And as you can see, I got everything right there. The pile of hoses and the canisters. But yeah, that was one thing. And let me show you how the exhaust came out. And as you can see, that's how everything looks like already installed on the Blondie. And I'm pretty happy the way it turned out. Let me lower it. That way I can turn it on for you guys. Okay, whenever you're doing something like this, always make sure that you always use a jack stand. Because you never know when the jack is going to fail. Okay, we're going to do a before and after let's see let's see how he sounds So that's the before. Now we can go ahead and start it up. Let's see. I'm gonna set the phone right here. There you go. I'm start it up. Sounds pretty clean. So there you go. The Blondie has new exhaust. Nice. If you like these videos, please subscribe, like, comment, and see you guys on the next one. What, you think the video was over? No, it's not over yet. This is, it has been about two months since I put the exhaust system in it. So this is like the follow up. And I'm gonna show you the way it sounds after two months. Check it out.
and this is the way she sounds. After two months, I've been using it every day. The way it came out, I like it. Sounds pretty good. Let me show you the inside. Because I don't think I have showed you the inside since I put the new carpet. So what I did on it, we did a new carpet. See the dash is nice and clean. We did a new headliner. Overall, the truck is pretty clean. I don't have to do anything else. What about the back? Put the new shocks on the lift gate. I still got a bunch of parts that I need to put on. Well, not a whole lot of bunch of parts, but it's just the. Uh, the weather seals on the on the doors and I should be done with it but so far it's been a good truck since I bought it there you go Check out underneath the hood because I did a little bit of cleaning in it too. As you can see, I uh, I clean all the inside, took the uh, the canisters off, and I also did a new carburetor. Put a holly in it. Check it out. And it runs beautiful. The AC is cold. But yeah. Nice. I hope you guys like the blondie because me I love it <laughs> I'm pretty happy with it uh, the next thing I'm gonna do I'm gonna do the window tint but it's just gonna be ceramic film I don't want to put window tint on the, on the front windows so it's just gonna be the clear ceramic film all around the truck because I do have a lot of glass. Check it out. <clears throat> and other than that, it's ready to go. That's my baby, my daily driver now. So now it is the end of the video. Bye. Te gusta, Junior? Te gusta? Eh? Tan padre?